my name is Kao Putsu and I'll be showing how I draw the step-by-step -step of this dispenser of the mechanical pencil with the front wheel of something like this on AutoCAD. So this is at, on the 3D modeling space with the USC set to world, our view set to southeast isometric and visual style set to conceptual. So usually I will start it off with a line here first that is 0.8 zoom it in if it's too small and now we're changing the USB to right so from here we'll draw a circle that is 1 and then another circle here that is 1.2 and then we'll have to lock both of this cross section only so from here we'll draw another circle that is 1.2 and a line here so we'll know the distance 0.2 and then a smaller circle at the front that is 1 so lost all of it again 1 2 okay. cross section only so once we have this one done Select both of it and then copy selection. Specify base point at the circle and place the base point at this circle. Right. Now we have the front part then. From here, press pull this length here with the length of one. And from here we draw another circle, one two three. Press pull it to the length of three. And here we draw another circle, one two three, with the length of zero two three. And from here we draw another circle. Point 0.8 and then lock it again okay. mm -hmm. so from here another line with the length of 7.2 it's a bit longer this time so another circle at the back here 0 0.8 and then a circle at the front with the diameter of 1.5 and then lock both of it okay. so from here we do it again and line 0.5 Circle at the back, 1.5, circle at the front, 2, Lock. and then do it again, one last time, set the length of 2, Circle two and then here three. Lock it. And now we got the whole shape done. So from here, make it all of it one object by you. And then, so now it's one object. So from the center here, draw a tiny circle of 0 0.5. Press pull it. Right until the end. Hold. 
and we get a hole through the whole thing now. Mm -hmm. So from here, right now we're gonna make the front part here now. So we will start it off with a polygon. Number of sides, tree, enter, enter, inscribe and circle. And I'll draw a line from the sides of the triangle to the center, to the center, and another one here. And now I'll set the offset with a distance of 0 0.05. Select object to offset. And then with a distance here, offset here, offset here, offset here, and then offset here, and offset here. And then I'll have to delete the line at the center. And then just press pull area on the inside with line of 9.7 and do it again for this side with the line of 9.7 and then for this side as well 9.7 and then click this And circle here. And we're done for the whole thing. That's all. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. Okay, hi. Now I will show you how to draw the sleeve of the mechanical pencil. Okay, first we use the circle on the di diameter. Yes. Circle on diameter of 8 for the outside. Zoom in a bit. Then we use uh, diameter 7 for the inner side. Okay, we use a common common press pull on the height of seven millimeter. Then we use line for fifty five millimeter. Okay, now we try to create the inner diameter of the mechanical pencil. We have to create the smaller curve like that around the mechanical pencil Then we use common revolve for 360 around the mechanical pencil. So 
So we use the revolve for 360. Then it will be like this. Then we use a common extrude for a height of 81 millimeter. At the end of the mechanical pencil, we use a smaller radius than an upper side because the mechanical pencil have a different type of diameter. Sorry, I mean diameter, diameter, not radius. Then we press pull it again for the length of 10 mm. We use a circle command again for the inner side of the of the smaller smaller side of the mechanical pencil. Extrude Extrude for the height of 3, 3 mm. Then we have to delete the inner side because we have to left it with a hole. Select object and we delete. So there's a hole through the mechanical pencil. Now we have to make the line at the tip of the mechanical pencil. We adjust the line so that it will be same as the tip of the mechanical pencil. We copy then paste alongside of the smaller radius one to make the line for the mechanical pencil. Okay, done. <laughs> so with, uh, now I will proceed to make a hole for the push button with a diameter 8. Okay, now I will make a hole for push button with a line command with given dimension 20 and 4 millimeter. Then as usual, press pull again and move it to its position. Move it to where we want to make a hole for the push button. Then use command sol solid subtract, select the object, enter, then select the object that you want to subtract. Then it will create a hole. Okay, then now I want to build the wall part of the push button hole. We have to create a not really triangle triangle not really triangle shape. Then we trim the unwanted part.
Now I will use the command loaf to create a solid space between the cross section. Use loaf, select the object, then it will create a solid 3D solid object. Then I use a mirror again for the parallel part. Now I will, I will move to its position. Then it will be like this. Delete the unwanted line that we create. Now we use for the last step. What for the last step? We use a command solid union so that it can combine into a single object. And then we're done. The sleeve of the mechanical pencil. Thank you.